the lake is fishing really weird. Uh, it's unlike I've ever seen it, and I live here. It's uh, It seems like the fish are really trying to be offshore, and they're offshore in a lot of places, but they're not in their usual places. Um, they're all in a lot of different areas, um, doing different things than normal. So uh, it's going to be interesting. I think that what's going to come down to is the guys who have two or three spots that are a little bit different than everybody else. That's what's going to make the difference and the guys who win, the guys who just place like the rest of everybody else. There's a big one. Big. Or there's one. He thought, man, I'd be big. I have no size. He ain't that big. He ain't that big. Keep fishing, buddy. Okay. Uh, current's pretty, current's pretty, pretty key. Um, if you don't have something shallow, if you're a deep fisherman and that's all you're doing is deep fishing, then uh, it, it means everything. Thankfully, we've got a few places that are a little shallower, um, but for the most part, what everybody's catching them is deep. So uh, what that current does is it makes them position themselves on a, on, on a ledge to where you can catch them. Um, otherwise, they spread out. That, that current makes them group up in one spot. So uh, instead of one, one fish seeing your bait, you know, 40, 50, 100 may see your bait at a time. And so I like my odds a lot better with that current and so that's why no matter what happens this morning, whether we have just one fish when we leave here, we got five, no matter what happens, I'm gonna be confident we're gonna catch them simply because of that current. 